Welcome again to Sligo, a town in celebratory mood as it stages the 64th Flat Kill Meheran. Our opening music comes from a group calling themselves Breaking Trad. Niall Murphy from Armagh plays fiddle, Donald Murphy from County Limerick is on accordion, and backing them is carry guitar player Mike Galvin. They're playing reels including McNaughton's and Wing Commander Donald McKenzie by Phil Cunningham. Grand set of reels there from Breaking Trad. You're a hussy and fly, need to quag a hen. You're a coupe of hay, Dinion. Back in Mullingar, I'd say they never envisaged that this would become such a big multinational event with so many visitors. And some very welcome visitors were a group of Galithian musicians and dancers bringing their folk culture to Sligo along with some very unusual instruments. from Galicia, which is northwest of the Iberian Peninsula, and uh, we are here all for enjoying the flower. Uh, this is a herd gurdy, uh, as the, in the English name, or we call it sanfona in Galician language. It's basically a fiddle mixed with a pepper grinder. What I mean is, instead of a bow, I have a, a wheel, which I turn with a handle, and, instead of, uh, and I have a keyboard to make melody here with these with this keys. Not only are the clouds gathering in Sligo, but so too are the crowds. And here on the corner of O'Connell Street, we've got a Galway-based outfit giving it a set of reels. They are Porterhead.
Scar to Glen Road, ending that set of reels from Porterhead. As well as the excitement and lively music of the FLA, there's another important happening. Skalaiksha, a place of learning for some 700 musicians from Ireland and abroad. It's very much about teaching by example, like here at Park King's Accordion Class. All the traditional music disciplines are taught, including singing and dancing. Skalaiksha visitors are mainly young Irish learners, but there are some mature overseas participants as well. I'm from Germany um, and I always have loved uh, uh, traditional Irish music. The singing, the listening and of course the dancing too. At first I was a bit afraid going there at my age because it's a summer class. And I thought, oh, they're all uh, young people, kids uh, and teenagers. But in fact it's not like that. There are a lot of adults too and it's a good mix. So you can profit from each other. I'm glad to be here. The fiddle continues to be an extremely popular instrument, reflected in the 10 full classes of this year's Galatia. Well, I have friends in Sligo, so I thought um, it's the one I have to go. So I'm here. It's nice to see particularly young people play. And when I came into the classrooms, all of kids thought, that oh, yeah, it's maybe easy. But actually, they're just brilliant. But the big thing is uh, I can play with Irish people that is the, the dynamic thing. I'm a violin teacher, and I'm here at the Scholatia for the first time with a group of five kids. They're having a blast, and it's a, it's a joy for me, and I, I'm not here alone with them. There's, I've got like 12 parents in tow, and we're all enjoying watching the kids bond, and. Um, making friends uh, here in Ireland to hopefully be lifelong friends and, and people I look forward to seeing in, in, in coming years. I'm happy to be here too. There's lots more to learn. There's, you know, you, I'm hearing stuff I've never heard before and um, I learn a lot. Teacher and motivator Mitch Fanning, broadening his musical skills at Skalaiksha and passing it on to his pupils from Washington, D.C. Four of them calling themselves the Bog Band, playing confidently on the streets of Sligo. The Garibog River in Sligo is wide in parts and it makes the perfect setting for a classic song from the legend that is Maura O'Connell. And love is sweet when first it's new, but love grows old and waxes cold and fades away. Like morn and dew, there is a ship and it sails the sea. She's loaded deep as deep can be, but not as deep as the love I miss. I know not how I sink or swim But the water is wide And I can't cross o'er And neither have I wings to fly Give me a boat that will carry two, and both shall row, my love and I, and both shall row, my 
I love and I How about that? <laughs> the water is wide on the banks of the Garavaux, sung beautifully by Mara O'Connell. Wonderful you, to see you again. Thank you, John. Uh, you're kind of a, almost a stranger to these shores these days, are you? I am and I'm not. You know, I still live in America, but any old excuse I have to come home, I, I'm here. Yeah. You know. But Nashville is uh, is your residence. Let's put oh it that gosh, way. it yeah, is. Yeah, has yeah. been for 28 years or something now. Yeah. Even though I'm from Clare, and you know, you you know music by osmosis there. Yeah. Um, traditional music music was never my my 40 or no. my 50 <laughs> but I did get over myself and made a record as you get older and get over yourself you know you appreciate what's around you and what you come from you know but when you come home and you hear the Irish tunes jigs and reels does it do something to you kind of at an oh, emotional always, level? always I mean the arrangements and the thought and the musicianship and the new musicians coming up and the yeah. sessions they're all great I the mean, youngsters are fabulous aren't they? fantastic yeah, really yeah. really good thanks so much <laughs> you're very welcome Moral thank you John thank you thank you thanks a million Despite the plentiful supply of street entertainment at the FLA, there are those who just love the friendly pub sessions. And in a way, this is at the heart of the FLA. Driving this session are Paul Taft from Westmeath and Fiddle, Seamus Hernan from Sligo and Flute, and Rodney Lancashire from Cavan and Concertina. And they're joined by visiting musicians from all over Ireland.